That is the uh, first year they made the C15. It's the 6NZ model, and this is the motor that everybody wants that likes Caterpillar. Because when they made the C15, the, the, C the following years they put the EPA crap all over it. And they were still good motors, but this one here don't have any EPA on it, and it, but it has the computer, and it being so what it is, it's like so you the, it's, it and it's like better. The, oh yeah, it's like the E model, but better than the E model. Yeah. So, and uh, so yeah, so if I get rid of this truck, I want to keep that motor. <laughs> I've always wanted that motor. So this is better than the 3406E CAD? Yeah, it's an upgrade. From the 3460E, uh, 3406 Yeah, they've improved, they improved the block. And uh, see now the E models always had leakage problems, remember? And they proved the block on this, and it stopped all the leakage. Oh, sorry. It's got new type. It's got a different type of pan. It's got a different type of plate. Uh, it's got all. They improved all the gaskets on it. So, and that was the problem with the E models. So when they built this, they solved all the problems they had with the E model. Well, you were constantly fixing leaky oil leaks. That's on why the... I'm happy to have this, because I ain't going to be constantly fixing oil leak. So is it pretty much a guarantee that it's not going to leak? Nah, it's not a guarantee, but... But you won't have the problems that you... Um, I don't know if you ever saw all those old videos of where Stephen was fixing oil leaks on the 3406E. Yes. This here, I don't know what this is. This got to come off. It's, uh, so you're supposed to put oil in it. Yeah. And as it needs oil, it's supposed to go over into the oil pan, but he said it never worked. And then I'm, I'm going to take that off too. I want a regular filter. And he took the pump off. He said they leak. I've never had one leak in my entire life. So, so what you do is when you change the filters, you'll you'll lose pressure and you'll pull this up and you'll oh it pumps it, pumps yeah, it back yeah, up. Yeah, you straight down. Do that. Well, he took that off, put the plate on there. Put a plate on it so you can. So I'll go get another one put on there. Was that a good thing to put down the plate well, on? Well, he did it for insurance, but again, my whole life, I've never had one leak on me, so why would I take it off? Yeah. It's either that or you have to crack uh, uh, one of these valves here and then turn it over until it bleeds, until it bleeds the air out. Where'd you end up going to get this? It's up in uh, Michigan. Midland? It's up by Cadillac, Michigan. Midland, Michigan. All the way to the top. Yep. I've he been. hopped on a plane out of Nashville on Friday and and uh, went and brought it home. <laughs> drove her back. I guess a good test drive. <laughs> yeah. yeah it, test drive it ain't. I drove it with one finger all the way No, on. you didn't. Yeah, I did. You drove it with one finger. I did. <laughs> it drives like a big Cadillac. So. That's good. It's got Michelin's wrapped around it. She drove real smooth. No shaking, no vibrating. In fact, it was even smoother than the black truck. The black yeah. truck always you put 500 miles on it. And ain't no oil pouring out from under. The black truck uh, <laughs> always had a vibration to it. This one here didn't have it. Somebody was telling me that it was uh, that the drive lines the one that caused that vibration, but this one don't have it. So if if we had the resources, which we don't obviously, but if we had the resources and we could afford it, would you buy back your old truck? No, you're ready to move on. Away from that motor. <laughs> <laughs> I got the motor. that would be it right there. Away if from I that got motor. a good deal on it and put this motor in it, then maybe yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Well, this okay. one guy gave me nine. Was it nine miles a gallon on the way home? Is that good? Seems pretty good. Nine. I think it was nine or eleven. I can't remember which one it was. Well, what were you getting out of the cat, um, the 3406E? It would get nine tops. Its lifetime average was 6.2. Okay. So that's just an extra mm -hmm. in case you blow one. Keep one on hand. Yeah. Well, thank you, Todd, for coming out. And um, so I guess we'll have to schedule a day where the sun's shining, I guess. Yeah, hopefully this week. But Stephen says it's going to rain most of the week. We got a couple of days. We got a storm was. coming up here in Texas. So. I'm Big Buddy. And I'm Bumbles. And we are Big Belly Bumbles. Bumbles.